was right seeing you. Same. Hey, next time you come up. <laughs> you know me, dog. <sighs> Why well, I left the north to get away from that whole weather. And it gets hot as hell down here in the summer, so... How do we play it by ear? Hey, babe. What do you think about going up to New York? As long as we're not driving. Any place where we've got to go that's more than three hours away, we hop on a plane. <laughs> happy wife, happy life. Are uh, you ain't moving right back? No, I'm good. How have you been since, you know? What do you mean, since the accident? It's been about a year since then. Thank God for speech and physical therapy. You were down in those Bloody Marys pretty hard. You know I can eat. Especially that big ass breakfast you and your fabulous wife made. I, I know, but... After some drinks, I'm okay. You're starting to sound like my folks. Mainly my old man. He's concerned about you. What? Just like me, about your drinking. You talked to my dad? I did. He reached out to me. What? <laughs> Listen, you, your parents, are my extended family. You're like a brother to me. So I'm concerned. And your mom and dad, of course, worry about you. I'm a grown ass man. I'll be all right. Hey, Marty. I uh, want to get on the road soon. We have a long drive ahead of us. Well, happy girlfriend gets laid tonight. Hmm? It was so nice to see hey. you. Love you. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right. So, are you going to tell him? <sighs> I hope he's ready. So, all right. We'll let you know when we get in, okay? okay. All right. It's more economical. What's this? Please, do me a favor. As a friend, hold on to it. Please, you may need it later. Listen, ever since what happened to me, since then, all my so-called friends disappear, except you. That driver lives with the guilt for the rest of their life. Hold on to that card. Don't do what that man did to me. Okay. Oh crap. What happened? I got a dead. The head? The bathroom. I'll, I'll be right back. Nature calls. Are you well? Feel 10 pounds lighter. <laughs> <laughs> you feel better? Uh, yes, dear. Oh, one more thing. While you were talking shit, Shelly told me about some construction that was happening at like one of the railroad crossings. So she said, be sure to look out for the detour signs because if not, then it's gonna take longer for us to get back to I-95. Okay, fair enough. All right. Yeah. Mm -hmm. What'd you do with the keys stuff there? Yeah, the rules hiding the keys. Oh, whatever. Are you ready? Let's do it. Let's go. I gotta go get some gas. 
have you been looking out for the detour signs that I told you about? Yeah. None's come on. Okay. Oh, look. There's one. And a gas station right after it. <laughs> Hey babe, I'm going to go inside and get some snacks and water. Do you want anything? Mm, no, thank you. Cool. Hey babe, I got you something just in case you get thirsty. What'd you get? Some chips, some water, you know, two in a bag, one for you, one for me. Why are you looking at me like that? Mm-hmm. We should have been on 95 by now. I know, I know. I didn't see a detour. Wait, what? No, you were supposed to take the detour by the gas station. What? No. I took the right turn. No. Or... or... No, you were supposed to turn around at the gas station and then take the damn detour. Uh, you're right. Are you serious right now? You just had to have a drink more and you couldn't fucking wait? Let me ask you a question. Do you think you have a problem? Do you think I have a problem? What? I don't need a lecture. Are you sure? Because I saw the card that Dwayne gave you. And what about it? And don't play with me, Martin, okay? I heard the conversations between you and Dwayne. So you're eavesdropping on my conversation. Don't be a dick, okay? You have a problem, and everybody knows it, and everybody's concerned. So you heard about my father, too? Now you know I can walk and chew gum. All right. Okay, good, look, we're not too far. 95 is right up here. That was weird. What happened? Did you see that? See what? The person, the hitchhiker? And? It looked like a girl. I think we should help her. And? She's out here by herself. There's nothing around. 95 is the closest thing. Anything could happen to her out here. She could be raped or worse. Bit by a snake. <laughs> that is not funny, Martin, okay? What if it was me out there, all right? Or your daughter? What are you trying to say? Where is she? Right here. Well, slow down, slow down, slow down. You know it was 15 hours to New York, Just right? Stop this way. You don't want to leave her out here by herself. Jeez. 
Let's just see. Well, let's just see. It doesn't hurt to just check. You should dress warmly. Uh, it's appropriate for the season. Sure. Um, where you headed? Uh, just a mile or two up the road. It's not too far. You want to ride? If it's no trouble. No, no trouble at all. Right, babe? No trouble. Thanks. Oh, you can take your coat off, miss. Oh, I'm sorry. My name's Carol Maker, but Everyone I know calls me Blue, so call me Blue. Blue it is. I'm Tiffany. So, where are we going? Just as you go up the road, there'll be two subdivisions. Pull into the second one. Oh, my name's Martin. And my friends call me Martin. Martin, Tiffany, thanks again. So, why do people call you Blue? Well, my favorite food, or fruit should I say, is blueberries. I love some. <laughs> oh, sorry, sorry. Keep, keep going. Why do people call you blue? I would always make a mess when I ate blueberries. My lips and fingers would be the color blue. <laughs> That's why. That's original. So why aren't you driving your car to your house? Why are you walking? Can I have one of your waters? Sure. Oh, human sips. <laughs> oh, I needed that. <laughs> oh. Now to answer your question, I was at my folks' place, headed to the store, fixing to get some. Let me guess, blueberries. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> Before I left the house, my dad and I had a big argument on our way out the door. When I drove off, the next thing I knew, I was walking back to my house. So, what happened to your car? I miss my dad so much. I can see as when we're children, we don't see how important they are. Uh, my turn's coming up to the right. My address is 302 Main Place. So, do you miss your parents? I'm sorry, I just don't understand. Our parents have our best interests at heart, especially with our problems. Wouldn't you agree, Martin, when it comes to drinking? What? What? Oh, my God. What? 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 What happened? What? She's not here. No, what? No way. I need to get some air. No, 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 wait. Because, did you, what did you see? I can't talk about it. What? Besides, you wouldn't, you would What? Wouldn't. What, what, what? What? <gasps> What's the address? The address, um, 302, 302 Main Place. Okay, so, let's go to the address. We need to find some closure. Closure? Closure? Okay. Can I help you? Yes, um, are you Mr. Maker? I am. Well, this might sound kind of weird. Well, hello. 
first, my name is Martin, and this is my girlfriend Tiffany. And well, we 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 picked up a lady who said she might be your daughter. Her name's Carol, but she goes by Blue. You saw my daughter. You picked up Carol. She'll never find peace. I'm sorry. That was my daughter. She was killed by a drunk driver on the road. She'll never find her way home. I'm, I'm so sorry. What happened? She said she got into an argument with her father? That night, we got into a big argument. She just returned home from alcohol rehab, but she started drinking again. We were screaming at each other, and she went out to get some of her favorite fruit, blueberries. She's been trying to find her way home ever since. I'm so sorry about your loss. I think we should go. Miss, Mr. Maker, I, I do remember her saying that she missed you and she'll find her way home. Maybe all of this is not in vain. Maybe we were meant to meet. What's that? So start for the answer for my problems. Hello, Dad. Yeah, it's, it's a call I probably should have made a long time ago. I realize I've been selfish with my drinking, and I admit I have a lot to think about more than I know. Talk to you later. Oh. You might be a grandfather, so. Babe. Maybe you should drive. <laughs>